how how invincible can you be in the world and and whole and compassionate and more well balanced instead of building up your other persona to not be like them and put those type of traits in your shadow yeah so ultimately uh people that trigger us through their personalities in, in whatever capacity uh, they may are giving us an opportunity to go deeper into ourselves mm. to understand what where is the source of compassion in me and you know every time i'm triggered i always it's just such a, i have such love for the person who triggers me because i realize they're showing me a part of myself i couldn't see if they didn't show up and yeah. uh, the more extreme the more um I say the bigger the, the payoff because you really can get to another level of growth. And yeah. you, you can't really grow just by everyone agreeing with you and everyone telling you, you're doing a great job <laughs> and, and never triggering you. The triggering people are basically sacrificing their own self for you in a way to help you grow. And so yeah. we're all helping each other. And this this world is full of triggers and we... We, if we use it and not be afraid of it and um, and understand uh, that some people, I mean, all people, even if they don't have a disorder, we're all acting out of our own conditioning. We're not acting out of free will unless we're doing our shadow work and, and conscious and, and moving forward with our life. We have to have compassion for everyone yeah. because everyone's just, you know, working with stuff that, you know, they all had to deal with in this life and the defenses of the ego that they are not conscious of.